Hi, and welcome back. In today's video, we will talk about multi-criteria decision analysis technique in project management. It's an efficient and useful technique for making decisions in a project. In today's video, we will talk about what's a multi-criteria decision analysis, how is this template prepared in Microsoft Excel, and how is it used for making decisions in a project. In this example, we have three different projects. Out of these projects, we are going to select the project with the highest amount of benefits for our company. The first column in the multi-criteria decision analysis is the criteria. This criteria could be defined by the project management team and experts outside of the project. In our case, under the criteria, we have the location, the BCR or benefit per cost ratio, the necessary resources in the company, the duration of the project, and the client for each project. And in front of each criteria, we have the weightage. For example, for the location, we have 12 out of 100. For BCR, we have 40. For the resources available in the company, we have 20. For the duration, we have 8. And for the client, we have 20. Next, we are going to rate our projects from 1 up to 5 based on this criteria. In here, 1 is the lowest score and 5 is the highest score. Under the scoring for each project, the weightage for the criteria is multiplied into the rating for that project. For example, 12 times 2 equals to 24, 3 times 12 will be 36, 4 times 12 will be 48. These numbers are automatically generated using this formula. And then the total numbers are added in here. As you can see, Project SBK has a score of 340, which is the highest among the three options given in here. So as a company, one will go after this project. If we change the ratings in here, for example, let's make this 5, and let's make this 1, and for example, let's make this 2, as you can see, the scores for the projects and the column chart in here will be updated. So this is how you can prepare the multi-criteria decision analysis template in Microsoft Excel and use it for decision making in real life problems of your projects. If you enjoy our content, consider subscribing to our YouTube channel. Besides that, we are on Instagram and LinkedIn. If you are interested, you can follow us there as well. Thank you very much for watching.